In this program, we're going to learn about the desert. What is a desert? A desert is an environment that gets extremely low amounts of rain per year. Most deserts get less than 10 inches of rain a year. About one third of the Earth's surface is covered by deserts. There are hot deserts and cold deserts. Cold deserts are covered with snow and ice. Cold deserts are found close to the poles or at high elevations. Antarctica is Earth's largest cold desert. Hot deserts can be covered by sand, rock, salt lakes, stony hills, and even mountains. Most hot deserts are very hot in the day and chilly at night. The largest hot desert is the Sahara in North Africa. The Sahara is also the hottest desert in the world. Some deserts are getting larger. Areas that were not deserts are now becoming deserts. This is called desertification. It does rain in the desert, but not often. In the Atacama Desert in South America, it did not rain for 401 years. In other deserts, it may rain every year or once every few years. When it rains in a desert, a lot of water may reach the ground in a short time. Sometimes people bring water to the desert from wet places in order for plants and humans to survive. This is called irrigation. The desert is home to unique plants and animals that are able to survive the extremely dry desert life. Desert plants have many tricks to survive in such a dry environment. They are good at storing and finding water. Some plants have seeds that can stay dormant in the sand for a long time until there is enough rain for them to grow. In hot deserts, you'll often find cacti. Cacti are great at storing water. With their waxy outer coating, water can't escape. Some animals that live in the hot desert are cold-blooded, like snakes, insects, and lizards. Mammals that live in the desert are usually small, such as kit foxes. Fewer animals live in the cold desert. In Antarctica, most of the animals live near the ocean shore. Because of their ice home, seals, penguins, and other birds rely on fish, squid, and other sea creatures for their food.